My name is Ren, 16. I go to a high school near my house. Minato, my best friend since childhood, goes to the same school. He's a nice guy whom I can talk to anything about, and we ride our bicycles to school together. It's a coincidence that we're in the same class. I'm glad, though. Right? And we'll be in college three years from now. Yeah. We need to think seriously within these three years and make decisions for our future. You're right. We can't always play. Yeah, but play is play. There are no pretty girls in this school. Really? I thought so. I was looking forward to it. I guess we'll have to postpone it till college. <laughs> well, that's too sad. Did we choose the wrong high school? It's close to our houses and with modest deviation. So I thought it's not that bad. I thought there were pretty girls, but... Well, I think I prefer girls older than me. Older? I guess it's not bad. The problem is whether they're fine with those younger than them. Also, I think I prefer someone from an old girls high school. But how do I meet them? <laughs> Don't rush and go with the flow. Let's play games for a while. I guess that's a good idea. We're playing at your house today, Royce. Yes, are you fine with that? Okay. We expected a lot, but... The reality was way off from our expectations. We imagined a more glamorous world and thought we'd have exciting days, but the expectations fell far short and we gave up. Most of the time, we hang out at each other's houses after school for homework and to play games. Today, too. Bob Hope! This is my house. This is like my home, too. I feel at home here. I feel relaxed. That's because no one's here. Mom is quite busy at work these days and comes home late, so... It's nice and quiet. I guess it really is different when our advances to high school. Lucky, I found some food. Wanna eat? Really? Well, I love you, Bob's cooking. Let's eat. Hey, did you know? That our class president, Kumada? He looks so serious, but when he goes home, he's a complete opposite. Huh? What do you mean? Someone saw him with the delinquents in the neighborhood. And they think he might be a part of a gang. Really? He looks so serious. You can never really tell someone just by their looks. Yeah, it really is surprising. How about we do today's homework properly? Come on, Red. Uh, just as expected. I knew it because you don't like the subject. I really don't understand it. Please help my stupid brain understand. My brain circuits are tangled. I need to do something about it before it gets worse. Or else it might be forever broken. <laughs> We're going to have a special training today. Teacher, please teach me. There are times when he seriously does the homework. He's my precious friend. It was when I went to the science classroom. There was a book and a notebook, so we brought them to our classroom. Are you okay, Rika? You left this in the science classroom. You went to all that trouble to hand it to me. You have nothing else to do? What? Oh, I thought you would be in trouble without it. So I brought it to you. I'll be fine without that thing. You're wasting your time. Bye. Waker said that and went away. What kind of an attitude was that? Unbelievable. Girls like her who can't appreciate an act of kindness are the worst. Very unattractive. We shouldn't have handed them to her. Let's go. She acted like we were the ones wrong. And she didn't even thank us. It made me realize that there were girls like her, and I felt really bad. We went back to the classroom and attended a class like always. Finish! Weekend is finally over! Right, this week felt like forever. Let's hurry and go home. Sure. I felt free because school was over. We decided to go home fast, so we headed to where our bicycles were parked. But we bumped into Riker. You two. You also come to school on a bicycle? Something wrong with that? 
Well, I'm not saying it's bad at all. That's because of your facial expression. Oh, I don't understand what you're saying. Minutel, let's go home. Right, we can't be bothered. We rode our bicycles home. What's with her? She keeps poking us. She's crazy. Is she strong-willed or is she just strange? Or is she at a rebellious stage in her life? Whichever it is, I don't care at all. I don't want to meet her again. What will you do if you meet her every day? True Odyssey. Give me a break. Right? She probably doesn't have any friends. Huh? I never saw her with anyone. Really? Oh, she must be quite pitiful. Could it be that she didn't forget her stuff but purposefully hid them? That would make her more pitiful. That's because no one usually leaves her books and notebook there. Anyway, I don't really care. We've been waiting for the weekends to come. Let's play some games! <laughs> You're all fired up! Of course! Weekend Party Animal Minato is very popular. Popular? Where? At my house? <laughs> then it suddenly happened. A card high speed hit Minato. Minato! Are you okay? Then another car came at high speed. I thought that since Minato was on the ground, the other car might hit him too. So I ran too and. I don't remember what happened next. When I woke up, I was on the hospital bed. What happened? What happened to me? The doctor came and explained to me what happened. Hearing his words, I had mixed feelings. My mind went blank. I'm glad Minato was saved. I, I was saved too, but now? I have an artificial leg. I don't remember what happened next. My foot! My foot! Where's my foot? Tears ran down my cheeks. Why did this happen? The two cars that hit us were having a car battle. The drivers got scared, so they ran away. However, due to some witnesses, they were arrested. Then, when I tried to save Minato, I was hit by the second car and brought to the hospital unconscious. I was brought to the emergency room and immediately had surgery, and my leg was gone. Then, a week later, what should I do from now on? The doctor said there's a good artificial leg, but I guess nothing good will come out of brooding in the past. I'll just have to think positively. This is my life now. When I was staring blankly into space, that's when it happened. There was a knock on the door. I wondered who it was, but Minato appeared in a wheelchair. Minato! Minato, you all right? Red, I'm sorry, he said and cried. Minato, what happened? I was so worried about you. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. It's, just, it's my fault that your leg... What are you saying? It's not your fault at all. If I don't have an accident, it's my fault! Ren cried, but I couldn't move, so all I could do was watch him. Minato, we're both victims. We were just happy to have a broken leg or a lost one. And I was just unlucky. Those who did cat chasing at their place are the ones wrong. You're right, but if you didn't try to save me, you wouldn't have been in this situation. If I didn't help you, I can't even imagine what would have happened to you. I can't just leave you there. My best friend was hit by a car in front of me. I don't regret helping you. Red, whoever you blame it on, my foot won't come back. That's why I decided to think positively. What's important is what we're going to do from now on. That's what I felt this whole week. I'm really thankful to you. As you said, if you didn't save me, I might not have made it. Right! You're my saviour. That's why from now on, I will protect you. I will definitely. Thank you for saying that. I feel stronger now. We're best friends, so don't worry about it.
We need to keep moving forward. Brad, I'm really sorry. Let me do anything you want. He sat and came to my room every day after that. Then we spent our time like always. Minato, let's play a game. I really hate losing. You're really good at this. That won't work in the game. Months passed, and we finally were able to leave the hospital. Then, I did rehabilitation with my artificial leg. I couldn't ride a bicycle anymore, so I decided to ride a bus to school. Minato was traumatized because of the incident, so he also stopped riding a bicycle to school. So we both ended up riding the bus together to school. Thanks to Minato's help, I was able to graduate high school without a problem and moved up to college. I guess we're inseparable. I'm glad we ended up going to the same university. Two years passed since we started university and we turned 20. Minato met a girl and they're dating. I was shocked when I met his girlfriend. It was that girl, Rika. They bumped into each other and when they chatted for a while, they hit it off right away. The past is in the past. I was happy for him. However, they were already talking about marriage. Two years passed since we started university and we turned 20. When I thought of how Minato will soon become someone's husband, I realized that it wasn't just about them anymore. Then, the three of us decided to wed each other. Minato, congratulations. Thanks. Well, I'm not feeling it yet, though. <laughs> Rika, it's been a while. How have you been? Well, yeah. Anyway, about your foot. It won't heal anymore? Well, it's an artificial foot, so I can't walk properly. Hmm, how pitiful. Not at all. It's not like I can't do anything. And Minato helps me, so... Minato won't help you from now on. Don't expect anything. Because we're getting married. Don't say that! I will help you more from now on, Red. Huh? That's impossible after marriage. Are you saying that you'll sacrifice your family? That's not what I mean. Red is my savior! I don't understand what you're saying. Ren saved me from my accident, so I'm still alive and well today. I wouldn't be here today if it were not for Ren's help. Hmm? Really? It's not Minato's fault, so it's fine. It's fine. I just want you to be happy. Well, that's what he said. You won't have time for other things once you have a family. Rika looked dissatisfied. Apparently, she wants her family to be prioritized so Minato can't help me anymore. I don't think of asking for your help forever. I want you to be happy. Red, I want you to give a speech for my wedding. You're the only one for this. Me? Yes. I'll choose a barrier-free venue for the wedding, so... Wait a minute. I'll choose the venue. I've already decided, so there's one anyway. You have a lot of friends, so it doesn't have to be Ren. He's missing a leg, so I can't have him in my wedding. What are you saying? I'll ask Ren to do it. Of course, I can't just let anyone do it. We can't have our wedding just anywhere. It's a once-in-a-lifetime event. I won't compromise. Besides, Ren doesn't have feet. We shouldn't even invite him. They started quarreling. I thought of ways how to interrupt them. You don't have to strain yourself. I just want you to be happy. Just show me pictures the next day. No, I've already decided. So ask can't compromise. You can't respect my thoughts? I really can't have a disabled person at my wedding, so beat it. Minato went red and went livid. Hey, a hold of yourself. What do I just say? You can't have a disabled person at the wedding? Does that mean you'll reject me if I become disabled tomorrow? It doesn't happen all that suddenly. You won't become disabled that easily. Ren became disabled without notice. You became disabled easily. You said you reject disabled people? Then I reject you. I'll break it off our engagement and I won't get married to you. Does Ren really mean that much to you? Of course. How many times do I have to tell you so you understand? Please stop. Calm down. 
Don't worry about me. It's, it's your wedding. So please stop fighting. We're not fighting. See, she said she can't have a disabled person, so well, I'm rejecting her. If I become disabled, she would check me and leave me. I don't regret leaving someone like her. We're over. With that, Minato and Rika broke up. Are you really fine with that? There are times when women want their whims to be heard. Well, I don't think that's the case this time. We don't see eye to eye, so that means we're looking for different things. But you asked her to marry you because you like her, right? We started dating and it just led it to that. I should have thought about how she was in high school. Well, I didn't make it either, but I'm glad it wasn't after we got married. I should think I'm lucky. I see. Please don't worry about me. I wish you happiness. I want you to choose someone right for you. Red, you too. Don't worry, I have a girlfriend. What? You never told me? Since when? She's someone from my workplace and she's two years older than me. Until I make her happy, I can't marry her yet. But I'll do my best. I'll introduce you to her next time. Sure, <laughs> let's be happy in our own ways. I wonder if Minato is fine with his decision. Well, I didn't like Rika, so I hope he starts afresh and finds the one. Red, it's time for you to give a speech. I'm sorry to keep you waiting. Really? Actually, I'm getting married too. And I want you to give a speech. Really? We might be able to have a wedding together. <laughs> I have a speech at Minitel's wedding. And Minitel gave a speech at mine. It was a very emotional wedding. I will never forget it. People's feelings are priceless. Does it depend on how much you think of them? Disabled person? So what? I'm sure there are times when one is saved by a disabled person. That doesn't matter when it comes to true happiness. That's because you like them as a person. I still have a long way to go, but we'll do our best together. 